Hi, welcome back to my channel and welcome to Oxford Bay. I'm species hunting today in preparation for a tournament in a couple of weeks. We've got a little window in the weather and um, we're going to try and make the most of it and just yeah, have a bit of practice here. So we've got an ebb and tide, we're going to go out and try to find some of the bigger species first. Maybe a smooth hound, maybe a taupe. And then we'll come inside then and fish the wreck for the mini species. But first port of call is going to be some bait. Hopefully there's some fresh mackerel around. We just passed a score of fish coming out. So I've got the feathers out the back just for a chance to see if we can pick some up. But yeah, it's going to be a beautiful day. I'll see you out there. Uh, fresh bait situation yet, but we've come out, we've anchored over a little gully. I've got a ragworm bait out. See if we've got any, um, any flat fish around, even a smooth hound will take worm. Let's have a look. We're scratching today, like I said, we're in for the species. We got a bit of a, a slop from yesterday. Some big rollers come through. We had 25 mile an hour winds yesterday and it's supposed to pick up again in the afternoon, but the sun's supposed to come out. So we'll see how long we can do it. Right, ragworm down. I'll keep trying for bait. I want to try to target some bigger fish here and then when we go in over the reefs hopefully we'll target some conger eels and who, who knows what else maybe even a bass right yeah the other bait i've got today is squid prawns got some squid and some prawns prawns are going to target the hounds hopefully we'll pick up a hound here and then I'm just trying to get some fresh bait and then we'll really start targeting the species. I think that's all I got. A bit of a last minute trip, to be honest. It was a little bit heavier than the last one. The other dogfish weren't big. What's it gonna be? Oh, Mr. Dogfish. <laughs> this one ain't big either. Look at the size of him. Tiny little dogfish. Hopefully we're not plagued here. The last few times I have fished here, I've been absolutely plagued with them. A bigger one this time. Hooked lovely in the corner of the mouth. Another little bullass. Wow, a little bullass. Just halfway through eating my sandwich. And this rod pulled over, the other rod's going as well. I hope this ain't a dogfish. That would be terrible. No luck on the mackerel either, it's been very, very quiet. Very, very quiet. I'm with me other line, I think. Oh, it's a right mess. It's a smooth hound though. We'll take that. I've just put out a hole. Oh, steady, sad. I just put out a whole um, prawn bait, like a big one. Oh, that's all happening. I got three rods out because it was that quiet. Looks like we got a fish on the uh, feathers as well. Hopefully, that's a bit of bait. This <laughs> is <just> chaos. <laughs> Only a small hound, but one species. Well, another species. Let's see what's on this rod. This is chaos. Absolute chaos. Hopefully this is bait. Hopefully this is tote bait. Oh, 
all these lines are also together. It's a nice Gernard. Nice red Gernard. Absolutely chaos this is. Right, these guys are covered in spines. Literally, it was all quiet. I moved spot because I thought I was, um, my anchor was slipping, but it just turned out, uh, we've just got wind against tide. But yeah, check him out. Very pretty fish, very vivid blue along these. These guys just sit on the bottom, walk around. Yeah, what a great catch that is. So another species, we're on four at the minute. All of these are spines as well, absolutely covered in them. We'll get them back in a minute, we'll just sort out this absolute mess. All right, we're into another fish. So here's another doggy. Oh, it's another bundle of doggies. Christ. You've got to be on it with the baits. I left that one when I was, I was rebaiting another one. And that's what you get as a reward. <sighs> well, we've had our target species of a smooth hound. Um, no bait for the taupe, unfortunately. So I'm going to go in and try some for some mini species along the rough ground and the wreck over there. My mate's just arrived, so he's going to join me as well. So uh, let's get our paddle on, get these rods in. We've got another bite on this one. It's going to be another doggy by the looks of it. But I'll tell you what, it's a really good season for the jellyfish. There are loads of jellyfish coming through the tide. in there. Little rat. Oh no. Just drifting over the wreck um, while the anchor is sort of making its mind out what it's going to do. A little, little rat. Species number uh, four. Let's get him back. Uh, I'd flick it away from you, mate, and then you can leave it on the bottom then. Uh, not too much, no. Um, a couple of smooth hounds, uh, red gurnard, loads of dogs. I just moved out sort of only a few paddles, really, just over the edge of this uh, little drop off. I'm straight into a fish. Oh, another little species, I think. Woohoo! Tub gurnard, I think. Yeah, look at the colours on him. Vivid blue. Get in there. He might be a tub. They all look pretty same to me. But yeah, another little fish. Right, that's it. I'm going to head back in now. Thank you very much for watching. We had a few species today. It was four, five, five or six, was it? We had um, a dogfish, a bullas, a uh, balamras, uh, a gurnard, a smooth hound, and possibly a red gurnard. I'm not too clued up on my gurnards, to be honest. So, yeah, five or six species. So it was a good little day. I wonder what that... Uh, what result I would get in Oxwich in a couple of weeks time. But yeah, thank you very much for watching. It's a little hint about what's to come at Oxwich. The clarity shit, but there's a few fish to be had. So I'll see you on the next one.